I wanted to have an intellectual life that combined science and the arts, and it was much more likely that I would be able to maintain a diversity of intellectual interests if I had a primary focus in science. Driven by a scientist's curiosity and a physician's sensibility, Harold Varmus has been one of cancer research's pioneers for more than 30 years. What was difficult was to understand how to identify the genes that played a significant role in cancer, and that's where cancer viruses uh, became very important players in the story that unfolded. For the revolutionary discovery in revealing the genetic origins of cancer, Varmus and colleague Michael Bishop were awarded the 1989 Nobel Prize and inaugurated a new era in cancer research. I decided that whatever credibility I had achieved was an occasion for thinking a little bit more about uh, how I could contribute to the scientific community in general. Molecular medicine is a field of, of biomedical research. As director of the National Institutes of Health in the 1990s, and now as president of Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center, Varmus continues his commitment to cancer research and biomedical policy issues. Cancer is going to be with us for a long time, and we may never completely eradicate it. If we can make some significant strides against cancer in the next decade, uh, and if some of those advances occur at this institution, I'll be pleased.